Family owned restaurant and a favorite in the Chatsworth community is a total loss after a fire ravaged the building. And Cornelia Nicholson joins us live from Chatsworth with that story. Cornelia. Well, Cindy David, the Chatsworth Fire Department was here all morning investigating exactly how this fire started. Now, as you can see behind me, the building is completely gutted and this is truly a staple in the community as many community members have been here all day taking a look at the damage. Now, the owners, they tell me that they're just thankful no one was injured. The Little Brome restaurant has been in Tyler Hoard's family since the 1970s, passing down from generation to generation. Over the decades, the restaurant became a popular spot in the Chatsworth community, serving up fine Italian food. We've got to, just like myself, see everybody grow up. Um, everybody's got their own little memory, their own date nights and anniversaries here. Horde says they closed up shop Tuesday, just like any other night. But when he locked up, he never knew that would be the last time he would close those doors. The Chatsworth Fire Department says a call came in around 1 a.m., about fire shooting out of the roof. Uh, it happened about an hour after we closed up. Uh, I started, my employees were listening to the police scanners and, and called me and, and rushed down here and it, it went up pretty quick. Multiple agencies were on scene to tackle the fire, but because of the strong winds, it took over an hour to get control of the flames. The fire destroyed the restaurant and everything in it, but they were able to salvage some memories. Oddly enough, just some pictures, some good uh, pictures of my stepdad, of, of me and my family. While the restaurant is a total loss, Hort is thankful nobody was inside when it happened. It could have been a lot worse. Nobody got hurt, you know, thankfully. And uh, I'll take that. If there's a silver line into it, I'll take that. On social media, the community has rallied around Hort's family and staff as they mourn the loss of their restaurant. And honestly, that's what, that's what kept me together last night and this morning is just seeing the outpour of prayers and uh and best wishes and everything from everybody and i i hate it took something like this to to realize all that but uh i'm, I'm glad to see all the support now Hort says this isn't a goodbye but they do plan to rebuild back bigger and better and welcome the community in for some Italian food. Live in Chatsworth, Cornelia Nicholson, Local 3 News.